we are as a people, inherently and historically, opposed to secret societies, to secret oaths, and to secret proceedings. Behave yourselves. <laughs> so that is the secret to Lumacorp's success. Control the head, and you control the body. We've seen the outrageous headlines this summer, zombie-like behavior from people using the synthetic drug bath salts. Well, now there's a case in Gwinnett County. Police arrested a man who they say stripped down to his underwear at a driving range and threatened to eat people. Fox Eyes, Chris Shaw, live in Lilburn tonight with that story. Chris? Well, this case is so bizarre. It's so far from what we normally hear about that people are going to shake their head when they hear these details. Some may even laugh because it just doesn't sound real. Well, police say what happened here, dealing with someone high on bath salts, is a part of their dangerous new reality. He came out of these woods screaming, witnesses say. But he wasn't yelling for. What was he saying? He's just saying like animal sound, kind of the animal just, sound. Yeah. It was an odd sight to say the least at Atlanta Golf Center. Police say Carl LaVenture on his 21st birthday showed up here, grabbed a junior club, and began running around hitting balls. The owner of this driving range couldn't believe what she was seeing. Were you scared? Yeah, we were a bit of skill. It's not like a human. It's not like a human. Like he didn't seem like he was human. No, just like an animal, wild animal. And what he said was just as wild. Subjects ranged from God to rapper Tupac to cannibalism. Among other things, he was saying things like, I'll eat you. I don't want to eat you, but I will. Please say when they showed up, LaVenture, who by that time had stripped down to his underwear, this is his shoe, came running right at them. Just in a full sprint. Uh, didn't seem to be responding to anything they said. Or anything they did. They say he wiped away pepper spray from his eyes like it was nothing. Then it took four hits with a taser to arrest him. When paramedics got to the scene, they were able to give LaVenture a drug that seemed to bring him out of his haze. And that's when police say he told them several hours earlier he smoked a joint with some bath salt sprinkled on top and he didn't remember anything else. But at the hospital, the paramedics' drugs wore off and police say LaVenture once again fell into his bad trip, lunging off his hospital bed at officers. Before they could get him under control with the two officers that were present and the security personnel that were present, uh, present he had gone through about another seven cycles of being tased. Now, police say part of what makes this drug so dangerous is that the high, the bad trip of the high, can last for several hours, as in this case. They say the person doesn't feel pain usually, as we saw at, after he was tased over and over again. And they also say that the person really doesn't know reality and has these delusions, has these, uh, sees things that aren't there. And that makes their police job so tough. And they say they are seeing more and more cases of people abusing bath salts like this. Reporting live in Lilburn, Chris Shaw, Fox 5 News. All right, Chris, thanks very much. You're not a soldier in Cali. Don't make me at you for For You're not real for baby. Look, you know, you know. Biggie, that too far. And thank you for uh, feeding <laughs> the Bush family.